On this episode of Ask a Geek, we'll be answering the question, does Superman need to eat? The short answer is no. He doesn't have to eat. This is shown in the comics and outright stated in this clip from Superman, the animated series episode, The Late Mr. Kent. Dinner was hard to pass up. I hadn't eaten all day. Not that I needed to, but old habits die hard. I f However, even though we know that he doesn't need to eat, the why gets a little more complicated, and not something I'm going to dwell on too deeply, uh, but I did want to give a little bit of information. Superman comes from a race of people called Kryptonians. His people evolved in a planet called Krypton, a planet that had a much higher gravity than ours and much more deadly creatures. According to most sources, the planet became a desert or icy planet. Combine this with deadly creatures, the Kryptonians didn't have much source of food. On top of that, the red sun gave out much less energy than our yellow star. The humanoids of Krypton evolved to recycle their body chemistry with exceedingly high efficiency, with quite possibly only needing energy to carry out their chemical transformations. Kryptonians are believed to have skin cells that photosynthesize all photons of light. Even though they do photosynthesize in their cells due to their sun having less energy than ours, they probably also had to survive off of traditional food, too. A scan of Superman's internal organs shows a full set, although different than ours. So, you know, again, this does suggest that Kryptonians do have to have normal eating and digesting, and quite possibly on their planet, because their sun was such a low energy, that absorbing the light and the photons wasn't enough, um, and they did actually eat and they could eat. However, this normal use of their organs isn't needed on our planet. Kryptonians already evolved to be energy efficient. Superman being under the yellow star that gives up a much, much higher energy can actually sustain him and power him. So that's kind of the short answer. So no, he doesn't need to eat normal food, but yes, he does require energy. It's just that his people evolved to photosynthesize the photons and the light, and it's actually what energizes them. And he can actually eat, and it is a human habit. It's just something that comforts him and it has just become a norm for him. You know, he even has said he gets hunger pains and all that because he did grow up human and he did grow up, you know, eating those meals all the time, even if he doesn't need to. And chances are, if he were on a planet like Krypton with a, a red star and less energy, he would still have to find other things to sustain himself because it wouldn't be enough. So thank you for joining us on this episode. We hope that you found our information helpful. If you have any questions for us, such as where did Time Lords come from, you can hit us up at Roarst on Twitter and go hashtag AcidGeek, or you can always message us on Facebook at facebook.com slash myroarst. As always, like this video, subscribe, it really helps us out, and you can follow us on any of the social medias by clicking on the pictures. The Tale of Shepherd book isn't a happy one. As a young boy, he was known as Henry Evans and lived with his extremely abusive father in a small apartment. Every day upon coming home, he would hope his father was asleep so he could listen to his music and escape into another world without the fear of being beat. 